This season, the Premier League has seen 16-year-old Angel Gomez play two minutes for Manchester United and 41-year-old Shea Given notch up 450 minutes for Stoke City, before the Potters realised that maybe signing Lee Grant was a better idea. Gomez was the only player born in 2000 to appear, while Given appeared in this world presumably already with enormous hands and a tendency to misjudge crosses in 1976. In total, 543 players played at least one minute of Premier League action in 2016-17. These players account for all years of birth from 2000 to 1979 without break, only Given was born before 1979 and played. Looking at the number of players per year who played a minute or more of Premier League football, we can see that the largest number were born in 1989. 87-90 accounts for the bulk, with 42 players being born in 92. 91 and 85 both saw 36 players appear born in those years. Unsurprisingly, the years with fewer than 10 players born appearing in the Premier League were those for the youngest and oldest players. However, looking at minutes played, it becomes apparent that, while the bulk of minutes are still accounted for by players born 87 to 91, players from 81 were clearly crucial to their teams, racking up significant minutes despite only numbering 8. Compared to the 25 players born in 96 and the 19 players born in 97. If we therefore look at minutes per player as an average, we can see something rather different. While 1989 saw 68 players used born in that year, these players only averaged 1,480.5 minutes across the course of the season. By contrast, the 8 players from 1981 played an average of 2,055 minutes each across the whole season, or roughly 23 games duration out of 38 available to each player. The 1981 cohort, for example, comprises some key players for their respective teams, including Jorelio Gomez, who played every match for Watford. 1979 spike is due to Gareth McCauley rather than Paul Robinson. The West Brom veteran played 3,143 minutes, and as only two players born in 1979 appeared in the league, the year appears high in the minutes per player list. What does this tell us? Firstly, that each Premier League team uses a lot of players, in part due to expanding squads, loan rules, and the attrition of a highly physical league schedule in the modern era. The second is that while players at each end of the age curve are used, they tend to be used more sparingly, with the bulk of playing squads clustering around the 26 to 30 age bracket. Nonetheless, some veterans not only turn out regularly, but are critical parts of their teams. These players might be keepers like Gomez or 1980s Arthur Boric, but can equally be hard-working midfielders like the astonishingly durable Gareth Barry or a team's main goal threat like Zlatan. In short, while the age curve is what you might expect it to be, Never underestimate the staying power of modern footballers with enhanced fitness regimes and a new professionalism. And don't get too excited about young talent getting regular minutes in the league. Of the 32 players who were born in 97 or later, only Everton's Tom Davies and Manchester United's Marcus Rashford even broke the 1,000 minutes barrier. The future might be bright, but the present is still, sometimes, Gareth McCauley.